Agni, the sacred fire. Every morn, my mother lights a lamp, believing the flame spreads purity and piousness. As children, we love tinkering the bell. She put tikka and taught us the ritual to move our hands on top of the flame, take its warmth and spread it on our face. I understood the fire as a pious element then. When my mother cooked food, she would take a morsel, offer to the burning angiti, then give us food. There were no gas burners then. That was her way, seeking blessings to sustain the family with abundance. I understood fire as a provider then. When my younger brother was born, Pandit lit fire to wooden pieces, dipped in ghee and camphor in the haven kund. Puja took place amidst mantras and announced the first letter on which the name to be kept. I understood fire as an omen of blessings then. When I grew up, the ceremony was held around the fire lit in the haven kund Going around seven times, I tied the nupital knot, igniting the fire of love. With the promise till death do us part, I understood fire as a love witness then. I also witnessed a sad event. When a family member died, a small diya kept by his side to proceed with the rites. Then on the pyre it was torched. From dust you come to dust ye meet. I understood fire as a transporter to the other world then. Then once I saw the jungle fire spreading wild, a devastating demon. The whole day fire travelled along from one forest to the other. I was dead scared, shocked and pained. I understood fire had devouring power too. Every day I do my silent prayers, facing the sun, an embodiment of fire and light energy, fill every cell of my being with its sacred light, diffusing negativity, filling my world with loving light. I understood the sacred fire that sustains us all. The Agni God has its reign over the three realms. On earth it shows up as the element of fire. With lightning it shows up in the atmosphere as the sun in the sky removing all darkness. Of the fire from tiny flicker to the devastating self, the fact remains written on the wall, handle with care and it shall serve you all.